What's up guys, Danny here. Today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak your Apple TV on firmware 4.4.4, otherwise known as 5.0.1, Pod2G, Neato TV. Make sure you check out the links in the description. These are the guys that have been working on this. Uh, obviously Pod2G recently has uh, created the Untethered Jailbreak with the help of the Chronic Dev Team and the iPhone Dev Team. Neato TV has been working with Pod2. Uh, and created obviously an update that will allow you to untether jailbreak your Apple TV. Highly recommend you doing this, if not just to check it out, see what jailbreak's all about. But a very simple and easy jailbreak. All you have to do is download some links that will be in the description. First one is a uh, season pass. It will open up this here. Uh, obviously boot tethered will not be needed anymore, which is fantastic. So all you need to do is create IPSW it'll automatically download it so don't worry about downloading it um, I do suggest that you do go to iTunes and uh, restore to a stock firmware so just update it normally as you would season pass will download this I will speed up the video obviously so it's nice and quick once I've done that I'll come back to you okay so the firmware has almost downloaded we're just waiting for that to finish up now the nice thing about Season Pass and Firecore is it basically does everything for you. So it tells you what it's doing, um, it opens up iTunes, reinserts the firmware back to the Apple TV. So it is very simple. At the end of the video, what I'll do, I'll put a video up you can click on. It will take you how to uh, put tw uh, tweaks and um, install packages via terminal. So basically you go into terminal, just like that, you open that, you gain root access to the device uh, and then you just install what you want, so uh, Neato TV, um, XBMC, uh, you know all the other tweaks and things that come nicely with the jailbreak. Okay, so what you've got to do now is put the device into DFU mode, I'll uh, just put the camera up so you can see. What you need to do is press the menu and play buttons on the remote for 7 seconds. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Once you've done that you can release and uh, the device will be recognized in DFU mode and it will continue to run the jailbreak process. Okay so very quickly you will see iTunes pop up on the screen and uh, Fire Call Season Pass will automatically choose the uh, customized firmware. Don't have to click anything at all, it's doing it all by itself and it's extracting the software. Okay, so iTunes is just verifying the Apple TV restore. We should be done in any minute. Once that's done, there'll be a pop up on the screen just to say that your device is rebooting uh, and then we can plug it into the TV and show you what you're left with. Just want to take this time guys to say you know if you could subscribe to my channel i really appreciate it i do spend a lot of time working on this just to bring you uh the best kind of tech news and information that you can get i've also got a website mrios.devices.com links are all in the description to all my social sites uh twitter facebook you name it basically if you've got any questions leave it in the comments below i'm more than happy to help anyone out uh you know i enjoy doing this and you know i want people to have the jailbreak and you know it's it's just my way of uh, helping you guys out so i do appreciate all your likes favorites uh, and sharing basically so the apple tv has been restored what we can do we can click ok we can come out of this okay guys so i've just finished with the macbook pro now what i'm going to do is just unplug the apple tv so we've got apple tv just there and we'll just plug in the two connectors. So I won't do a minute. So that's the power in, and then followed by the HDMI cable. So there we go, there's the Apple TV, and on the screen, and there we go. So uh, I'll just input the details quickly. Hopefully, I can do this. Okay, so I've just put my password in.
not sending the information, no thanks. And we should have the screen, there we go. So um, as you can see, there's nothing jailbreak wise on the Apple TV for the moment, apart from Firecore just down there. What you need to do is uh, go into terminal and SSH into your device. It's very simple, very easy to do. Make sure you check out the video at the end of this video and uh, that will show you how to do it. Thanks a lot guys. Bye -bye.